We're so proud to represent Coach Flynn. I mean, you can just tell he's a great American. He's a great father, a great husband, a great pillar of his community there. Uh, his wife is, is, uh, is, is uh, uh, strong as well. I wanted to highlight for you a video that we produced uh, highlighting the story of our client, Coach Flynn, in Massachusetts. I told you about uh, the coach a few weeks ago. Uh, we're representing him in a case against Denim um, uh, uh, officials over uh, De Denim, which is a, a community up in Massachusetts. He was fired from his high school uh, uh uh, football coach position for objecting to Black Lives Matter and critical race theory propaganda in his daughter's ancient history class, who the daughter was in seventh grade at the time, and retaliation for complaining about it and, you know, just complaining quite professionally about it, he was fired. So we have a lawsuit, a civil rights lawsuit on his behalf. And we've explained it in uh, this excellent video that we produced. And I encourage you, I'm going to take a break here and we're going to play a little bit about it. My daughter brought up and says, I don't understand this. And we noticed that it was not ancient history and world geography that she was learning. She had to answer these bubbles that were coming out of a screen that determined whether she was a Democrat or a Republican. She didn't know if she was doing it right or wrong. She didn't know if she was supposed to answer it this way or that way. It was completely opinion based. It had nothing, there was n nothing about facts. We wonder what does this have to do with ancient history or world geography? It was just an outrage that somebody who uh, simply wanted to know what his curriculum was for his young daughter was fired from his job. Not only did they fire him, but they told him in the town that he was being fired because he exercised his First Amendment rights. You feel helpless. You know, there's, there's nothing you can do about it. Cancel culture on steroids down here in Denham. It's just unbelievable what they're doing to this man and his family. So we're back here. Uh, you can see that's a great video. Uh, you can uh, view it in full on our YouTube channel. Uh, we have a link here or just go to our uh, YouTube slash uh, youtube.com slash judicial watch. You can watch it there and it's online at our website at judicialwatch.org. Uh, but you can see why it's a uh, it's an important case where we're so proud to represent Coach Flynn. I mean, you can just tell he's a great American. He's a great father a great husband, a great pillar of his community there. Uh, his wife is, is, uh, is, is uh, a strong as well, wonderful person. Uh, and you can just tell that this is the right thing for Judicial Watch to be doing. And, and our lawyers are so proud to be doing this work. And uh, Mike Bekesha, who is uh, uh, one of our senior attorneys here at Judicial Watch, is uh, taking the lead on the case up in Massachusetts. So I encourage you to watch the video, share it, and get the word out about this because this is endemic in our in our nation. Uh, this propagandizing by the communist left, uh, uh, targeting our children. As I said, this race-based uh, communism. I don't know how else to describe it. Uh, could be the undoing of our republic if we let it get out of control. So we're going to fight it where the law allows. And when people's rights are being violated by those who are promoting this outrageous this, uh, this outrageous propaganda targeting our children. Uh, we're going to come in and defend them where we can. So we're proud of the case on behalf of Coach Flynn, and I encourage you uh, to learn more about it. And if you like this and the other great work that we're doing that I described in this video, I encourage you to support Judicial Watch. There's one thing I don't do enough on these videos is ask for money because we get contributions, and you should be giving contributions to Judicial Watch. If you are already, thank you. And I encourage you to give more contributions to Judicial Watch. If you aren't already, I encourage you uh, to support our work directly. And in the least, share the wealth in terms of the information that we're uncovering on behalf of you, the American people. Our chief goal is to educate you about what the government's up to. I mean, these lawsuits highlight government misconduct so that you are better equipped, as I say, uh, to, to stop it and tell your politicians and your elected leaders to stop it. How, do you, how can you stop bad things if you don't know what's happening? So we're essential to the functioning of our country, dare I say it. 
And we do it because we have the support of millions of Americans like yourself. Thanks for tuning in. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel to catch all the latest news from Judicial Watch.